Hey guys, I'm going to show you an easy way and really cheap way to make muskrat stretchers. I don't personally use this kind that I'm going to show you to make, but I've seen a video somewhere a long time ago and just decided to show you how to do it. It's simple. All you take is a solid boot, solid board, wood muskrat stretcher just for a template to trace and then some this plastic board uh, I got this from a friend um, or a place that he works at but this is the same stuff that they use for poli politician signs along the road this is the same thing and what you want is the you can see there's lines in it you want that to lo run long ways when you trace it so what we're going to do is lay it down to the end here what you're going to do is then just trace it Then you got your, uh, get it traced, and take your utility knife, and just cut on the line. That's a lot cheaper if you're going to have a bunch of fur to put up and you have a bunch of rats to put up. It's a really cheap way if you have a way to get the plastic, then yeah, it's really cheap. You don't have to spend a bunch of money on wood to make them or buy them or buy wire stretchers so once you get it cut out you can see it's not the straightest but I mean it still works it doesn't really if you're putting up lots of fur it doesn't have to be perfect but that's about it you just you can even it up if you want there's a couple places here But that's pretty much it. It's ready to use. So, it's a pretty fast and cheap way. I mean, I just made this in a couple minutes. So, if you find a bunch of the big signs around, you can make 20, 50, 100 of these things. And it make a bunch of them, then once they get worn out, if they get bent and then they crease and then they don't work as good, you can just use pins on these. Just pull your rat down over, you know, pin one on the tail, on the back, and one on the belly, and that's it. And you can also probably just take and just make a hole. A hole here. Just make a hole in the end where you can hang it up. So I might give these a try this this winter. So maybe hopefully th this will help you out if you don't have enough. If you don't have the money to go out and buy stretchers, this will give you an idea how to make stretchers easy I'm not sure if it would make cocoon stretchers or not but you might be able to to double it up to make it thick enough because one would be way too flimsy for a coon so maybe if someone uh, 
watches this video and makes makes one for a coon, let me know how it works out and I might look into that. So I'm always looking for more coon stretchers to make that are cheap and stuff. So let me know and comment and subscribe. I'll, there'll be more videos about trapping and fur this winter. So talk to you later.